Yo, what's up, dudes? Come on and show you this. Check out the new axe. It's just a loner, but uh, you know, it's okay. This is a Vola. I want to make sure I get this right. Vasti, V A S T I R F, uh, in vintage ivory gloss. And you know, it's, a, it's obviously, um, you know, a T style, but I like that they, they mixed it up a little bit. It's like the least T-style T-style I've ever seen. The only thing that even makes it remotely look like a T-style is this top horn and the arrangement of the, uh, you know, the pickups and the, uh, you know, the electronics here. But the body shape has been I mean, recut quite a bit. And, you know, that's certainly not a, a T-style headstock. Um, maple neck. Rosewood fingerboard. Uh, body is what? Ash. Okay. <laughs> ash. I would. I was gonna guess alder, but uh, it is ash. And what do we have for? Okay, pick a, a Godo bridge and Godo tuners. I like these wonderful vintage style tuners. You can see those. I'll get them on this other cam if I can. And uh, and then their their Vola pickups, which are beautiful. Um, really like these pickups. They sound like a typical T would sound, you know. Really like the sound of those. And then here's, that's the neck. Here's uh, both pickups. There comes that T-style quack. It really comes from that separation. Then here is the uh, the bridge. As you can see, it's um, you know, it's a nice uh, double blade. <clears throat> What's crazy is that it has this push pull, right? Uh, all right, pull it out, push it in, right? Push pull pot. You would think that would be a coil cut for this pickup, right? But it's not. It is, in fact, a boost. I love that. Because now I can go to my other patch, like my more metal style patch here. And, uh, you know, it, it, it works. It, you know, it just... Versus when it's in, a little brighter. You know, not quite so metal, but I pull that out. All of a 
seconds metal. I like that. I like just a little bit more versatility. All right, let's check it out. Clean. The neck. You wonder if it's a reverse cut. Because I don't think there's a battery in it. it. Sounds great. And it doesn't distort. tone here uh, maybe uh, I don't know something like a contemporary blues <laughs> in so they're in the standard mode. Those mids just burst out. really dig this guitar. I, I, I liked it a lot more than I thought I was going to like it, I'll be honest. Uh, it's got a, a large C-neck. Uh, they're made in Japan. 
uh, these volas, these vintage uh, style volas. Um, I love it. I like the neck on this. It's um, it's pretty much the same as one of my other uh, you know Fender style guitars. Or uh, it, it, it's it's funny because it's supposed to be the same the same size as the Blaze, but for whatever reason the Blaze felt a little bigger. This doesn't feel quite as big, although I think they're listed as the same size, which is a, uh, is it a medium C or a large C? What are they calling it? They're calling it large C. All right. The only down thing, the only negative I have about this guitar is that I find this knob and this switch a little too close to each other, and I found myself accidentally hitting the knob sometime. Other than that, that could be just as simple as putting a different knob on it. Sounds and plays so killer. And I love that pull out. dudes the vola what's it called again vasti vasti v-a-s-t-i-r-f in vintage ivory gloss right there let me make sure you can see it here yeah i can see you you can see it there you go yeah nice stuff nice stuff I like the Vola stuff. I gotta say, I've been impressed with everything that's come through so far. All right, dudes, I will leave a link down in the description. You check it out, and there you have it. All right, as always, thanks so much for hanging out, and rock on.